Oh man, boy. We got the woods car loaded up. That's right. Doc's taking his woods car over to Blue Holler for round two of the Junkyard 500 races. Hopefully he does well. He's done got his car fixed up and ready to race. And maybe I'll get a little bit of seat time in this 2.30. Don't know how much footage I'll be able to get on it. But we will see. Doc Shane will get his Pioneer loaded up. And I guess we'll be heading out to Blue Hollow. So someone on our cruise got an Odes or Odie side-by-side. -side. I don't know. I've never heard of the brand in my life. 16 model. Looks like a pretty good outfit here. It says 12, 15, 17, 91. I think it made boats or something then. Yeah. Looks like a real workhorse. It's got winches on both sides. Got a hitch right there. Looks like a real nice machine. We're drag racing a 400 versus 400. Mmm, that one was hard to tell. Getting this race going. Doc taking the lead. Look at that dust fly. coming through. He's also got a flat tire. Actually, I don't think he busted the oil paint. I think his blowed up last time. I'm not for sure. Boom. Now, he's just taking her easy, just about. does it for this real quick race. Doc took first. Licking a little transmission fluid, but we're getting fixed up. During that race, he had a little hole in his tire, but don't worry, we got his replacement going right here. So they put it like Doc's getting ready to do something crazy to finish his car off. I don't know yet, but we're getting ready to find out. Oh no, he ain't gonna do what I think he's gonna do, is he? Oh my goodness. You folks do this often? Oh, well, you know how it is when you get a country boy behind the wheel. <laughs> that car needs to be orange and a zero beside that one. Go across. Man, it's kind of a workout. Here it is. You know, in wintertime, I can see Days Pro Bass from here. Without on them leaves on the trees. Someone needs to fall down. We'll get that on video. Good live action right there. So we just found this spot recently. It's not really a cave, it's just a little crevice. You can walk up in here. It's 
couple pretty good little step offs down through there. All right, I hope y'all enjoyed this fun video. Seeing Doc hit that jump just reminded me of the General Lee so much I couldn't stand it. But I did get some good seat time in the 230 and I'm really liking it right now. Suspension's not really being a problem so far, but anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. And if you did, please leave a like and consider subscribing if you're new. Spread the word about Team Wax Off-Road. And Doc Lane with that jump, and I'll see y'all in the next video.